The National Academy of Sciences Award in Chemical Sciences is awarded for innovative research in the chemical sciences that in the broadest sense contributes to a better understanding of the natural sciences and to the benefit of humanity. Recipients Source, National Academy of Sciences Jennifer Doudna for co-inventing the technology for efficient site-specific genome engineering using CRISPR, CAS9 nucleases. Armand Paul Olivizados for making fundamental contributions to the controlled synthesis of colloidal inorganic nanocrystals, measuring and understanding their unique physical properties, and utilizing these properties for applications ranging from light generation and harvesting to biological imaging. Carolyn Bertozzi for founding bio-orthogonal chemistry, and applying this novel chemistry to install artificial sugars on the surface of living cells, enabling the study of their roles in cancer and the immune system. W. Carl Leinberger for his development of molecular negative ion photoelectron spectroscopy, and the fundamental insights into molecular electron affinities and intramolecular dynamics derived therefrom. Marvin H. Carruthers for his pioneering contributions to the chemical synthesis of DNA and RNA that made it possible to decode and encode genes and genomes. Gabor A. Samorhai in recognition of his pioneering experimental and conceptual contributions to the understanding of surface chemistry and catalysis at a microscopic and molecular level. Tobin J. Marks for groundbreaking contributions to understanding structure and function of catalysts, useful in the production of environmentally friendly plastics and new materials for the benefit of mankind. Stephen J. Benkovic for groundbreaking contributions to understanding catalysis and complex biological machines—the purinosome and DNA polymerases which demonstrate the power of chemistry to solve biological problems. Louis E. Bruss for his leading role in the development of a fundamental building block for nanoscience, colloidal semiconductor nanocrystals, and for his contributions to our understanding of the quantum effects that control their optical properties. Joanna S. Fowler for exceptional accomplishments in the synthesis of positron-emitting chemical probes, and for their implementation in biomedical imaging and studies of in vivo biochemistry, which have had a major impact on human health worldwide. Joanne Stubbe for landmark work on the mechanisms and regulation of ribonucleotide reductases, a compelling demonstration of the power of chemical investigations to solve problems in biology. Robert G. Bergman for numerous innovative contributions at the interfaces of physical, organic, and inorganic chemistry, including the discoveries of alkane carbon hydrogen bond oxidative addition and 1,4 benzene deradicals. Samuel J. Danishevsky for his wide ranging accomplishments in natural products total synthesis and for his pioneering chemical synthesis of carbohydrates for the development of anti cancer vaccines. Thomas C. Bruce for his leading role in the development of bioorganic chemistry, and especially for deep and lasting contributions to the understanding of enzyme mechanisms. Robert G. Parr for being a pioneer, leader, and central figure in the development of density functional theory in chemistry and for his deep insights into quantum chemical calculations. Harry B. Gray for his demonstration of long-range electron tunneling in proteins, his inspirational teaching and mentoring of students, and his unselfish service as a statesman for chemistry. Elias J. Corey for his brilliant and useful contributions to the theory and practice of organic synthesis and to chemical biology and medicine. John I. Brahman for his wide-ranging contributions to the fundamental understanding of chemical reactivity, especially the acid base, nucleophilic, and hydrogen bonding properties of ions and molecules. K. 
K. Barry Sharpless 2000 for his discovery of chemical reactions the Sharpless asymmetric epoxidation, dihydroxylation, and aminohydroxylation which have revolutionized organic chemistry by transforming asymmetric synthesis from near impossible to routine. John D. Roberts 1999 for defining modern physical organic chemistry the integration of physical chemistry and organic synthesis applied to the study of the relations between the structure and reactivity of organic molecules. Alan J. Bard 1998 for his fundamental developments in mechanistic electrochemistry, electrochemiluminescence, semiconductor photoelectrochemistry, and scanning electrochemical microscopy. M. Frederick Hawthorne 1997 for his fundamental contributions to boron chemistry, especially his groundbreaking studies of boron hydrides and metallocarboranes and their uses in catalysts and radioimaging. Ahmed H. Zawail for carrying out the pioneering work that established the new field of laser femtochemistry, using ultrafast lasers and molecular beams to probe the dynamics of the chemical bond in real time. Isabella L. Carley for her development of a method for determining essentially equal atom crystal and molecular structures by X-ray analysis, thereby profoundly affecting the practice of chemistry. Koji Nakanishi for his discoveries on the structure of a vast array of important natural products and unique contributions to the role of retinal in vision. Richard H. Holm 1993 for his contributions in unifying the fields of inorganic and biological chemistry through studies of metal clusters and metalloproteins. Donald J. Cram 1992 for elucidation of fundamental questions of stereochemistry and reaction mechanism and for pioneering work on the synthesis and properties of designed inclusion host -guest complexes. Richard N. Zare 1991 for his pioneering laser-based techniques, deep insights, and seminal contributions, which have influenced every facet of chemical reaction dynamics. F. Albert Cotton 1990 for his broad contribution to modern inorganic chemistry and, in particular, for having established the existence and importance of multiple metal-to-metal -metal bonding. Ronald Breslow for his imaginative invention of novel synthetic methods, his enunciation of the mechanism of enzyme reactions, and his development of systems that mimic enzyme activity. Hardin M. McConnell for his basic studies, which enhanced the power of spectroscopy and increased our understanding of the structural and dynamic properties of membranes in living cells. Herbert C. Brown 1987 for his studies of organoboranes, which revealed important new chemistry and established them as versatile intermediates in synthesis. Roald Hoffman 1986 for his unifying contributions to chemistry, bringing together theory and experiment, quantum mechanics, and organic, inorganic, organometallic, and solid-state chemistry. Richard B. Bernstein 1985 for his scholarly research, distinguished by pioneering development of new methods, followed by brilliant theoretical and experimental examination of molecular systems having broad impact on current views of chemical reactivity. Henry Taub 1983 for his pioneering work on inorganic reaction mechanisms, specifically his discovery of inner and outer sphere mechanisms of electron transfer reactions, which profoundly influenced studies in biochemistry and organic chemistry. Gilbert Stork 1982 for his extraordinarily creative contributions to the synthesis of complex organic molecules by the development of novel methods and strategies. Bruno H. Zim for his contributions and influence in theoretical and experimental polymer chemistry, notably his work on polymer interactions, polymer viscoelasticity, the helix coil transition in biopolymers, the theory of light scattering, and the study of extraordinarily large DNA molecules. Frank H. Westheimer for his pioneering studies in applying physical chemistry to the understanding of organic chemistry and enzymatic reactions
Linus Pauling 1979 for his studies, which elucidated in structural terms the properties of stable molecules of progressively higher significance to the chemical, geological, and biological sciences. <laughs> 